everyone. Welcome back. It's Tatumus Prime. I am back with a special, unique unboxing. Um, as you guys have known, uh, if you've watched any of my fucking videos lately, um, a really good friend of mine, and mostly yours too, uh, Adamantium Matrix has opened up a new store. Uh, it's called Colossal, Colossal Toys. Oh, it's already starting off to where I can't talk. And as you know, um, my sister purchased uh, Galvatron, Titans Returns Galvatron, and Blitzwing from, from Jason's store. And uh, loving them, loving them. Can't wait to do a review on them. Um, and the part that makes this unique, I was allotted two toys. She was like, go ahead and grab yourself two toys. I was like, okay. So, of course, I took a virtual tour and uh, went through his stuff. Uh, mostly Titans Returns, because that's, that's really what I'm into. I, I, I'm not a bay former. We know that. Uh. I also forgot to mention that he, if you're into Star Wars and Legos, and especially Star Wars Legos, he's the dude you need to talk to. You need to go check out his store, because, uh, wow, holy shit, dude. I didn't realize you were that big into Star Wars Legos. But anyhow, I was expecting Galvatron and Blitzwing. And then... This fucking box shows up. I know Galvatron and, and Blitzwing are pretty decent size. I was like, man, he really packed that fucker good so it didn't get messed up in transit. Which he did. And I'll, I'll give you an example of what he uses, or did he use for mine anyways. This is just one layer of that thick ass bubble wrap. <laughs> Dude, you pack your shit safe, and that is awesome. Because, oh fuck, I don't even have one near me. When I ordered Springer from fucking Amazon, it came in one of them stupid white fucking barely bubble wrapped fucking packages. It's ridiculous. They're they're not protecting shit. Alright, so what we're gonna do I I opened it up and to my surprise <laughs> there was almost everything like we were going through his what he had to sell and everything. And uh I was like, oh, yeah, that's really cool. That's really cool. And I'm like, you know, and eh, nah, not quite so interested in that. Uh, oh, yeah, that's fucking awesome. Shit like that. You know, going through and just trying to decide which two I wanted. Well, now these have been opened. I, I of, of course, obviously, I opened it up to get my Galvatron and Blitzwing out. But then... I, I'm not gonna lie, I fucking opened up the shit and, and uh, checked them out. I have, he sent as a gift for my collection, because my collection, is, it was getting scary close to, well, now what am I gonna do with my channel? Uh, it, it, it's, it was getting to the point to where I was coming up with different ideas to change my channel because, well, without Transformers to review, what the fuck good is a review channel without shit to review? So I got Sergeant Cup. Man, I am glaring like a motherfucker. I apologize, guys. I am really trying not to get that glare. This guy is amazing. I did have to do a lot of nail polish on him. His right leg was so fucking loose 
I mean, it was horribly loose. Bad. But now, stiff as new. Perfect. Then, as I kept digging into the box, Titans Return Scourge. Try to get that, get that fucking glare off. I really like this toy. Yeah, you can see his bobblehead in there. Already, I'm barely moving it. Every one of them have it. I don't give a fuck. It's not that big of a deal. If I really, 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 really want to, I can tighten that up. No big deal. It holds a pose. That's what matters. The transformation is... It's so G1 in his alt mode. It's, it's really, really fucking cool. Really like it. Now this is the this one here, Mark. You know I've been talking about her for a long fucking time. Uh, Mark Rashowski. Fucking love Windblade. I got a Titans Returns Windblade. Jason, my friend, you have outdone yourself. She is awesome. I can see where people complain and bitch and moan a little bit about the simplicity of the transformation. But if it works, why complain about it? It's simple, yet very, very effective. It's not like transforming, oh, I don't know, one of them three-year-old Transformer toys. Or is it Cyberverse or some shit? I don't know. I'm not into that cyberverse shit. And she does have a couple things that I would change if I would have made her. I don't call them issues, per se. Um, they don't bother me. But if I were designing it, I would have changed a couple things. And then this guy. I have wanted this guy since the 86 movie. And I am so fucking stoked to have him in my collection. Fucking blur. I'm really, I'm sorry guys, I am really trying not to get that glare going. But yet be able to show off. Yeah, you're, god damn, that's glaring like a motherfucker. When we do the review on him, you won't have that. That guy... I can't think of anything wrong with him. I, I fucking love him. He is amazing. The only complaint with him that I could even think of is the one that everybody else is making a big deal out of, which I'm not making a big deal out of. It's His shield sticks really good to his back. But would you rather have it fallen off? It, it's not to the point to where it feels like it's going to break. So... I'm not too concerned about that. And then we have another box. Which I put these in the in this box. It wasn't packaged like that. Okay. Now, I thought these guys were fucking long, lame. I when they first came out and I first seen them, my opinion of them was shit. I didn't see a point. Uh, I just thought it was Hasbro just dumping more shit on, on us just to sell and make money. Until I got a Titan. And now that I have a Titan, I, I mean, I'm only partially using. But this one here, this guy, this guy's my fucking favorite, man. It looks like the land speeder from fucking Star Wars. It's fucking loudmouth. And that is fucking cool. His that alt mode is amazing. I fucking love it. I am I am it's almost colored like the land speeder. So I'm so close to customizing that. But it is amazing. I love the little figures. 
they go so fucking well with the Titans. And, and it makes sense to me now. We all know the weapon modes on these are shit. They threw that in for fuck who knows why. I have no clue why they made a weapon mode out of any of them. Because there's only... Yeah, there's only... None. They all suck. They all fucking suck. But the vehicle modes are really cool. Like, bronze is awesome. It looks like the little Jeep with the, the tread, tank tread. Loving this guy. And another step closer to finishing off my fucking mini bots. Fucking Cosmos, man. Fucking glare. Son of a bitch. Fuck it, let's do it that way. This guy is awesome. This guy is really fucking cool. They thinned him out some. Uh, they put him on a diet. Uh, I do have to give him that. Uh, I'm used to the fat, chubby Cosmos G1. So it's it's taken me a bit to get used to the, the one that went on a diet. But now that I'm used to it and transformed it a couple times, it's 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 fucking awesome. I love it. Okay, Gerard, Wolfgang one. I know you're disappointed. I know you're a little bit disgusted, but it's a step in the right direction. Now, Jason, Patriot Prime. You will be proud, my friend. Fucking Liege Maximo. And a Skull Grin. Fuck yeah. I don't give a fuck if he's only a fucking inch and a half tall. I have a version of Skull Grin. And I have Liege Maximo, which is a little guy to go with my Titans set, so I mean, I'm never going to use the fucking gimmick where you put it into the all spark and or attach it to the power to prime shit. That'll never get used for that. And the weapon mode on this is fucking horrible. <clears throat> Let's not fucking lie about it. The claw, uh, really? You could if you wanted, I guess. I don't know. To me, it makes no sense. Not done yet, guys. We're not done yet. Yet again, Wolf King, disgusted. Jason, you'll be proud. Megatronus. Bombburst. Wasn't it? Now, we, we know that I have, I'm just now starting to get into these guys, so... Was Bombburst his original name? Or did they lose the rights to that? His original name? Because for some reason, Bombburst doesn't sound right. I'm sure somebody, please let me know in the comments. But, he's fucking awesome. I fucking dig the shit out of it. He's a fucking bat. He's got a bat head. He's got that dumb claw, though. I, that The claw makes no sense to me. I don't... The weapon modes, to me, are throwaway. Uh, th that's just what they are to me. I don't know. They, just, they don't mean nothing to me. Okay, now we're going on... with something that's really fucking cool. I really dig the shit out of this. Fangry. Titans Returns, Fangry. That is awesome. I dig the modes. I mean, yeah, they're a little off. They're a little hokey. But for its size, and it just looks fucking awesome. I, I love it. I think it's cool as shit. 
and we're not done yet. Another one of my favorites. The, these are uh, the pretenders that I want to get in, you know, the full size, the original G1s. Quintus Prime with bludgeon. Fucking bludgeon. Fucking skeleton samurai. Fuck yes. How cool can you get? And the weapon mode on this does not suck. Show a picture of it right about right there. That is acceptable. I could I could use that as a weapon mode. I can see that kind of way better than the uh, the claw. And then last but certainly not least, we have Alchemist Prime, which I don't know who the fuck he is. Is that something they just made up? Uh, because I'm not sure, but Sub Marauder, that fucker looks badass. I really, really, really fucking dig it. And his weapon mode with the trident isn't bad. I don't mind that. The trident is different than the claws. But I'm, I, I love it. I love it. I mean, Adamantium, Jason, brother, my collection was starting, it was, it was getting, it was getting bad. Um, I was spreading out, trying to spread out my, my reviews and shit. Now I can start doing some fucking reviews and get some content out there. And these are awesome, dude. I love every fucking one of them, man. Every piece. Amazing. Amazing. I am so stoked. And then I have coming up I'm 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 kinda holding off on it for for a bit. Uh it, it's a a joint venture that my sister and my son went together to buy me from Colossal Toys. I almost I, I want to grab it and show you guys so bad right now, but I gotta I gotta keep some you know gotta keep you guys wanting to come back to the fucking channel and watch two minutes of each fucking video according to my fucking analytics. Most of you have already turned off by now, so those of you that haven't, I thank you very much. Jason you're amazing, dude. You blow my fucking mind. I, I you mind fucked me. I, I just I was not expecting this at all. I was expecting two transformers, and then you generously fucking you keep you kept my channel going. You're keeping my channel going. It's crazy. It's it's insane. I I would I just I don't know how to thank you, brother. You and everyone else that has donated to my channel, to my collection, it's, 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 it's just mind blowing to me. I don't, I don't get it. It, just when you think there's not enough humanity out there and, and kindness and, and good deeds and, you, you do shit for people. You know, I try to be one of them people. I hold the door for women when they go through. I help an old lady across the fucking street even though she thinks I'm on a fucking mugger. You know, it, it, you think that it never come, it's never going to come back to you. You just, you finally come to a point where it's like, you know what? I'm not going to stop being good. But when did it lose its meaning? When did it that paying it forward come around? Or when did karma fucking die? And 
obviously she hasn't she is in full effect through so many people there's Wolfgang one Gerard you got me back into this brother I wasn't even gonna do this I had two fucking transformers I wasn't gonna start my channel up again I was going to start viewing. I was going to be a viewer, but I wasn't going to be a reviewer again. You hooked me up. Mark Roshowski, another brother that I've had for 10 plus years. You hooked me up. Graham, you've hooked me up. Poptimus Prime and Autotot, you've hooked me up. Dave Hill, you've hooked me up. I mean, the list goes on and fucking on. And anyone that I didn't name, please, please, please forgive me. It's just, my mind is racing right now. I just, I can't get over the fact that, I thought my, I thought this channel would have been dead by now, to be honest. I thought I was going to run out a long time ago. Uh, Joel, Joel, Larkin's Lair, Patriot Prime, fuck. I mean, it, you guys have done so much for me. And it just, it's amazing, and I can't thank you guys enough. I really can't. Uh, I plan on doing a vlog here sometime soon um, about it and about my channel. Just an update, what's going through my fucking head. That could be really scary. Probably scare a couple of you. Some of the shit that goes through my head. But anyhow, this has been a 22 minute long unboxing. Jason, thank you, brother. I I, I never... I wasn't expecting this at all. At all, brother. I greatly appreciate it. Between you and Amber, you guys are fucking awesome. <laughs> You're my brothers and sisters, man. All right. This has been going on for too long. I need to stop yammering on. I'm trying to cut my videos down a little bit because I vlog and fucking do other shit at the same time. I need to separate them. All right, guys. Till next time. Oh, at the uh, end of this channel, or the channel, Jesus Christ. At the end of this video... I'm going to put a put up the link and the graphics again for Colossal Toys because you guys really need to go check Jason out in his store because he has some amazing shit. He really does. He's got really cool shit and his prices are awesome. Obviously. Or my sister wouldn't have purchased three items from him already. Alright guys, this has been Tatamus Prime with another surprise unboxing. Kind of? Oh, yeah. Surprise for you. Surprise for me when I opened up the box. I just, I couldn't not open them up and check them out. Alright guys, till next time, rock the fuck on.